Hello, it's Nick, British Legion. Uh, I haven't uploaded for a while, but uh, I'm here at uh, Napoleonic Fault in uh, Chatham. We've been here before, and I'm here with uh, my mate Steve. Hi there. The maniac. You're feeling I'm famous now. Hey, no. And uh, yeah, let's just, I don't think I can switch cameras. Let's just switch cameras. There's military barracks all around. All around. There we go. Here we've got the mortar position to fire into the medway, a whole battery of four mortars. There's more of the complex down there, the girls are walking up the hill, cool stuff. Let's see if we can get some more in a minute. So this is the highest point at the Fort Amherst. Amherst. So it's quite a commanding view of the area of defence, basically stopping the French from going up the river and then it was used as a civil defence centre in the First War and the Second World War. So everywhere you look you've got batteries of cannons. Oi, fatty! Ah! He turned, he turned round! Excuse me. A lot of the fault is off limits, it's quite ruined, but it's quite a large fault. Are you filming or are you just taking fun? We're at the fort! It's so exciting! Are you excited, Steve? Yeah. yeah. He's excited. It's great. Hey, we went to a wargaming show this morning and we'll show you what Steve got. Is he bought some loot because uh, Tristan has got the rules and he wanted to get them too because he wanted to be like Tristan. Didn't you? Get the loot. Turn it off. If you go down to the woods today, you won't believe your eyes. <laughs> hey! Isn't that lovely? Lovely! This is the War Memorial at the edge of the fort. Rather large. Uh, we've actually been allowed in, the gate was open, so we came in. This is actually a, a naval memorial, uh, I think from both wars. It's raining and uh, we're all caught out in the rain <laughs> and uh, we're all getting very wet. Is this the lower battery? It's one of the side tunnels. Come on, from here. Don't slip. Oh, Jesus Christ. Can't get down there. <laughs> oh. God. Oh, hang on. Take my <laughs> <laughs> Ninja skills. Right, we're we're back from the fault and we've got dried off. Uh, it got a bit wet, as you saw in the video before. Anyway, as I mentioned before, we went to skirmish in Sid Cup. Um, lovely show, and uh, they have like one in March and then one later on in the year. We went to today, and Steve bought some stuff uh, inspired by Tristan. So what did you buy? I bought myself muskets and tomahawks. Uh, it, this and the cards were a tenner, so I thought, so I didn't mind that, it's a bit of reading material. It's quite a good buy, really, isn't it? Yeah, um, and I got a few bits and bobs to go with it, because that's all uh, there was there to fit with the theme. Uh, so I got uh, a wagon. I got um, artillery supplies. To go inside the wagon. Mm -hmm. uh, military crew. You might paint tomorrow for the wagon. And some horses. Where are you get them from? Uh, Colonel Bills. Um, he's pretty much every single trade show going at the UK. Good guy. Um, so yeah, I might have a kit bash at that lot tomorrow. 
Uh, I've just ordered myself some British um, like Dragoons. Dragoons. As uh, young Nick here mentioned, watching uh, Atlas videos, Tristan's videos. Yeah, I'll put a link into. Um, I'll go and get Tristan's video. He does a lovely battle report on uh, muskets and tomahawks. So I'll put a link yeah. in below. Um, right. And then he inspired me to go and buy some stuff. So he did. Start with Dragoons, see how that goes. And then while I'm painting them, I could be watching his how to play videos. Cool stuff. Oh, yeah. Right. Say so see you later. See you later. Bye. Bye.